always trying to aim the fire in the opposite direction of anything that you might be able to burn or catch a fire. Such as the wood here. Now we'll let that sit for a minute and then we'll solder our other one so we can use that piece of metal to bring it over to this side here. Now we're ready to solder our other 90 in place. Gotta push that up in there, so. Now, this may push it down, but we still have room to push it up because down at this end, we haven't soldered those pipes together yet. And that's the reason I left that unsoldered to give me the uh, opportunity to make adjustments. Now let's solder this piece up over here. Now the solder is easily sucked in there. It's just following the heat. Where you put the heat, that's where the solder will go. Let's let that cool down and then we'll start back in the middle part. Right here we're going to bring our um, half inch water lines to the tub. One will be for the cold, one will be for the hot, and then you see the uh, two right there. Those will be for the uh, tub and shower in the basement when we put the bathroom in. But now we have the uh, pipes in place. And the thing about working between the floor joists is that you really don't have anywhere to hang any pipes. So in this case what we do is we just cut a piece of copper pipe, get a measurement from joist to joist, like so and that would be 14 and a quarter